introducing an orphan immigrant all the way from the Caribbean. His name should sound familiar, he's Washington Treasure. He travels greater distances beyond what you can measure. Let me introduce you to Alexander Hamilton. As I step off the ship into New York City, I stand in awe in all of this beauty. This is my chance at a new beginning. Here I know my legacy awaits me. Aaron Burr, I'm longing to lean. Go my jazzy well swim. I will not throw away my shot. I have to talk to him. Yorktown, 1776. I met this kid, says Hamilton's a name. He talks too much, he's all over the place, wants to join this war, a revolution, he proclaims. I really hope he knows it's more than just a game. Alexander, Aaron Burr. let me tell you some things. If you run your mouth, you'll end up dead like the rest. So keep your thoughts in your head. You can't be serious. But I watched you, admired what you did, how you stood up for your country. I see it now. You're more than just a kid. kid are you kidding me? I'm only 19, but wait till you see what I'll grow up to be. I know I talk too much and I'm loud. Sometimes I get up very excited, push it off like a mouth, and- Anyone has the right to speak their mind. Just let it be someone else this time, like Seabury. Seabury, that man is such a fool. He talks about the revolution, but has no damn clue. Alexander, what? please, now is not the time. Oh, it's the time, Bert. Don't tell me you forgot the- Battle, Battle of Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Yes, I saved you and your men, did I not? And where did that leave me? A promotion to you and me, a closed door to the face, my ruined pride laid at my feet. Oh, please, I've had my defeat. You ran against me and took up the sky with you stole my life, my reputation from me. It was never up to me. How could I be so naive? I think that you should There's leave. no need to shout. Burr, close your door on the way out. You bastard, orphan, orphan hostile, arrogant, cynical, poor son, immigrant. immigrant. Take a look at my failures and tell me what's the same. It's you, Alexander, you're the one to blame. Who are you to say that I'm the one to blame? You stood to the side, reluctant and afraid. I should have been the one to be by Washington's side. You intemperate kid, you let your pride run the show. Are you jealous, Burr? Do you think that you're better? You think you're my competition? Well, I beg to differ. While I was out defending the Constitution, what were you doing? You had to wedge your way in, stop being such a kiss up. I'll b it'll bite you one day, I swear, Alexander. You may not see it now, but I know you'll pay. Alex, <coughs> my, my first, first friend, friend my, my enemy, how did it come to this? We, we both, both lost our sanity. sanity. This, this isn't right. right. Something has, has to change. change. It's you or me. The, the world, world will never, never be the same. So tell me. Who will pull the trigger first? Is it you, Alexander? Do you wear your courage on your sleeve? No, you tell me. Will you end my life, Burr? Can you finish what you started? Yes. Are you sure, sir? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wait, click, boom. Now I'm the villain in your history. And my legacy will be left a mystery. I never wanted it to be me. I never wanted my story. I never wanted to end my story. If I could go back in time, I would have spared your life. If I could go back in time, I would have been on your side. If, if I, I could go, go back in time, I tell you, I'd I'm say, sorry. I'm sorry, Alexander.